Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check out how to do text tunnel in Illustrator. First step, let's select the type tool and type in something. All right, go to object, expand, click OK. From here, I'm going to press and hold Alt, drag it down. Also press Shift to isolate and press Control D to create some copies. I'm going to go with six copies, select all, right click, group. I'm going to swap it from field to stroke. I'm going to click on the stroke. I'm going to select the magenta. I can select the rectangle, press and hold shift and click here at the bottom anchor point at the bottom corner of the, of the left and go all the way to the right corner. I'm going to de decrease the stroke thickness. Now I'm going to create a new copy. I'm going to select the rectangle, press control C and control F. I'm going to press Ctrl Shift plus Alt, scale it down somewhere here. Okay, I'm going to select the text. I'm going to distort it, go all the way down here where they intersect with this rectangle. I'm going to press the letter E or you can go and select free transform tool. Select the perspective distort and you can see this dot here. Just drag it inside until they intersect with the path right there. See that? Same in here. I'm going to select it. Press and hold Alt, drag it up, press and hold Shift to isolate, drag it up until they intersect at the top. Now select it, press Shift, rotate it upside down, press and hold Shift, select the bottom one also, press Control C and then Control F, or you can go to edit, paste in front. It's gonna create a new copy, press and hold Shift, rotate it. And now we got this tunnel going on and you also can distort it like this. Looking good. And this is it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.